Tonight in Chula Vista, police are looking for the people who vandalized homes, cars, and sidewalks, or it might just be one person. They did all that with graffiti, including swastikas. CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez went to the neighborhood this evening and obtained a photo of a person who might be responsible for the damage. Tonight, neighbors have walked us around and shown us where graffiti was found on homes, cars, and even the streets. Here you can still see it on the front of this dentist office right next to the window. Really, really random. We've never had issues with um, vandalism. Felicia Carlucci and her neighbors are still in shock by what they found over the weekend. I've lived here most of my life on this street and nothing like this has ever happened. It happened around 2nd Avenue and F Street. Earlier tonight, Chula Vista police gave us this photo of who they believe damaged a car windshield. It's unclear if this person is responsible for the graffiti. Tonight, neighbors described all of this damage. Some wanted to be anonymous. All across our neighbor's garage door was painted the word unthinkable in bright turquoise paint. No idea what it means. Don't know why. On the blacktop in front of our house, it actually said exist. Then she found more graffiti around the neighborhood. The next day when I was walking, saw more of the same paint in a lot of other places and concern for neighbors because especially with the swastika, there's a synagogue very close by. Take a look here. You can see spray paint on several cars. This SUV's windshield was shattered. Her car was definitely <laughs> vandalized. Um, windshield looks like it was kicked in. Footprints very clearly visible on the car. Investigators believe there may be more neighbors in the area whose property was vandalized. If you have any information, you're asked to contact the Chula Vista Police Department. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.